everyone. This is Susie Q of Susie Q's Bunting Babes. And today I have Sweet Baby James with me. And um, I'm going to be uh, changing Sweet Baby James into one of his new outfits that um, that he that um, came in yesterday. And so as you can see, he's um, holding on quite uh, tightly to his buddy uh, Betsy. But Betsy to me looks like she is trying to get away. Um, you know how it is when with a little kid um, they always hold on too tight and so um, but I'm going to give Betsy some relief uh, right now I wanted to um, show you something um, you know Betsy is the queen bee of the nursery and so a long time ago when I first got Betsy I had gotten her this really pretty um, uh, dog collar that has her name on it in sparklies and so, um, since she's the queen bee, I, you know, I figured that she deserved um, a, a really nice collar for all the trouble that she has to go through um, taking care of all these babies. And um, so what I'm going to do now is uh, put Betsy aside um, because there's not room on, on the changing table for both of them. Um, they're two, um, Betsy's a big girl and sweet baby James is a big boy. And so we're going to put Betsy aside um, just for now, and um, they can play a little bit later. So the outfit that we're going to be putting uh, uh, Sweet Baby James in today is this really plush, uh, very soft blue, light blue uh, puppy outfit. And I love the little ears um, on this. And this outfit came with these um, soft um, little velour pants that has these uh, little stars on them and under <clears throat> excuse me underneath is going to be this um, this new onesie that I got for sweet baby James especially for him because he's the the new kid on the block and he is new to the crew and I don't know if you can tell or not but this um, this is not a white onesie um, it is a, it's a light blue it's like a pale pale blue so um, I thought that it would really go cute with this um, plush, uh, this light blue plush outfit. And then I chose these shoes, um, which have a little bit of gray in them, light blue and, and gray. And then these socks that have, um, uh, it's like a light gray stripe in them. And so this is what we're gonna be changing um, Sweet Baby James into today. So let's go ahead and get started. And um, while we are getting James undressed, um, I think you'll notice that outside my nursery room window, um, we do have some spotted snow. And um, so I was kind of disappointed. Woke up this morning just really hoping that um, I would be waking up to a winter wonderland. Um, but you know, the only snow we got yesterday was when it snowed during the day. And um, it did leave snow on the, the tree, the bare tree limbs, um, kind of partially. But the problem is the snow that, um, that we're getting, that we got yesterday, was, it was um, a wet snow. And also it was a heavy snow. And um, it, was, it was cold enough to freeze the snow everywhere. It's like when I was walking outside, there were, you know, it was making the crunch sounds and, and, th and then what the problem with that is it doesn't stick to the trees very well because it's, um, heavy weight, uh, he um, heavy, um, wet and slippery. So, um, plus the fact right now, uh, the weather outside, it's not that cold. It's like 34 or something outside. So the snow is starting to melt. So, um, I did not get my winter wonderland as anticipated this time around, but um, I'll, I'll tell you what, winter isn't over, and so I know that it's coming. And um, Augie was, you know, if, as you can see, Augie, he's all, he was all ready to have a winter wonderland outside too. Um, he had gotten up early and got dressed, uh, got his, his uh, parka, his warm parka jacket on, his boots on, and he was ready to go out and play. But then, if you'll um, see outside, uh, it's just really, you know, you can you can actually see the grass. Um, 
underneath the snow and it's very icy looking like little little tiny chunks of ice and so it is just not a good um, day for Augie to go out I think it's going to be way too slippery out there and um, you can't build snowmen in the ice and so that's my my executive decision for today is we're not going to go out in it um, we are we are simply going to um, play inside and enjoy the the nice fireplace I was trying to think um, of where to put this this smells so lovely and it does have um, white on this side and so I am going to go ahead and put this like this without the blue against his nice white um, uh, cloth body because I'm always concerned about things like that but um, I think if I when I put it the other way it'll be fine so here's his new to the crew which he is very much so new to the crew and um, I might need to with these sleeves and I might need to roll them up just a bit because um, as I compared him to the, the little um, furry bear outfit I think they looked a little long so we'll see but I was just insistent on using this um, on having him wear this onesie today because I got it especially for my little new to the crew boy and see this is a size zero to three months and you can see how it's just it's fitting really nicely it's a it's a stretchy type of fabric too which I love um, <clears throat> so it's easy you know it's like stretchy and it kind of is it isn't gonna be like a real sloppy sloppy look like too big look on him so I'm loving it so far and boy did I have a happy day yesterday I woke up thinking about the happy day that I had um, with all my happy mail the, the cards um, Deidre had sent me a Christmas card and um, Sharon and May had sent me some happy mail and um, you know with some really wonderful things and um, and also a beautiful card it, uh, they sent with um, May signing it and signing her mom and dad's name and it was just so s special and um, it, it just made my day and so I woke up this morning um, thinking about how special our friends are um, here in our in our um, in our Dolly community okay so this um, particular top that looks like it's gonna be really simple because it's got the snaps on the back and I love the way that the people in the UK call snaps. They don't call them snaps, they call them poppers. And um, it, that is such an appropriate name <laughs> for, the, for these snaps because they, they do pop. They pop, pop, pop when you, um, you know, when you undo them and they pop when you put them on. And so um, that's another term that I've just fallen in love with whenever I um, watch channels um, that that the um, the ladies are from the UK. Um, Suzanne of Suzanne's Babies says poppers, and I love when she says poppers. Um, but I love her accent anyway, you know. So, uh, but anyway, look, look at that. Isn't that cute? So far, so good. Yep. And you know, it looks like I'm not going to need to um, to roll up the sleeves like I thought because they they are hidden inside, and, and the snaps just went pop pop. So I've kind of I've kind of got them twisted around. Yes, I do. Oh, this is just really cute, and I love how soft it is. Okay, next come the little. The little pants and they have this little um, tie in the front and they have cuffs I love the cuffs on the bottom too stretchy little cuffs so yeah they've um, they've come a long way with boys clothes um, back in the day when I was dressing my little boy um, I have a daughter and a and a son but Anyway, they didn't have super, super cute stuff like this um, back in my day. So I've really been enjoying 
um, you know, getting all my little boys these cute little outfits. Oops. Kind of slipped up there a little bit. Oh, isn't that precious? Oh, wow. I'll hold him up in just a minute and give him a good snuggle before we sign off. But um, I'm loving this. He looks so, so good in this light blue, this powder blue boy. I'll tell you what. So we're going to put the socks on his cute little feet. Oh, so yeah, I didn't have any light blue socks. Um, I, I was surprised that I couldn't find any light blue socks, so I'm going to need to... Um, probably next time I go to Walmart, um, just pick up a, a pair or two of, of light blue socks. I didn't realize I didn't have any. I have a lot of uh, different colored, colored socks for the girls, but, um, but not for the boys. Uh, so I'm going to have to change that, aren't I? There we go. And these shoes fit him perfectly. They are <clears throat> they are a child of mine, size newborn. And I get my shoes. Someone had asked me about where I get my uh, little boy shoes. Um, the majority of my little boy shoes, uh, in fact, I don't think I've gotten any outside of Walmart. Um, Walmart ha usually has a really good selection of um, little boys and little girls shoes. So, uh, but they get snatched up quite quickly because they're, they're pretty popular because they're so cute. And so, um, they're about $7, I think they're $7 and 49 cents, um, per pair, which it's might be a bit much, but, um, I think they're, they're so worth the cuteness. So here he is. Here's my, my sweet little, cute little sweet baby James. And, um, for those of you who wanted to see Sweet Baby James in this outfit, here you go. And um, he's so cuddly. He's cuddly anyway, and then you go ahead and put this on him, and um, he's just, I don't know, he's just ultra cuddly. Okay, everyone, um, I'm going to go ahead and go. Uh, thanks for stopping by, and I've really enjoyed your company today. Hope you have a great Sunday, and until we see you soon, We'll see you again. Bye-bye.